Hello everyone, I'm Alex Cotter, and welcome to What to Watch For, presented by the SCSU Huskies Athletics app, where we cover the top stories in Husky sports. Let's get started. Husky senior goaltender Emma Paluzny made first team all WCHA, and with that, she received WCHA Goaltender of the Year. Paluzny is the first ever Husky to make first team all WCHA. This season, the netminder stopped 92% of the opposing team shots and only gave up three goals per game. Paluzny set some personal and team highs as well, breaking her personal saves record in the game while simultaneously breaking the all-time career saves record in Husky history. Congrats, Poe, on the amazing achievement. Husky softball had some of their players receive honors this week. Senior catcher Sydney Trees won NSIC Player of the Week. Trees posted a 429 batting average and knocked in 11 runs. Also, junior pitcher Trinity Junker received NSIC Pitcher of the Week. The Huskies' ace went 2-0 this last week, pitching complete games in both outings, struck out 10, and her opponent batting average was 180. The girls will travel with the team down to Florida for 12 games in 7 days, starting Friday at 9 a.m. against Southern Indiana. Seven Husky wrestlers advanced to the NCAA championship while they earned their sixth straight Super Regional 5 title. Paxson Kreese, Joseph Bianchini, Nicholas Novak, and Noah Ryan won their respective weight classes. The NCAA Championships will be held in St. Louis on March 11th and 12th. Coverage for next weekend can be found on Track Wrestling. Links will be available on the SCSU Wrestling page and the SCSU Huskies Athletics app. Men's hockey is off to Duluth this weekend for a series against the Bulldogs. While the series between St. Cloud and Duluth are always very competitive, however, this series will be even more intense as this will determine who gets home ice during the first round of the NCHC playoffs. The Huskies are currently two points behind the Bulldogs for the four spot in the conference. That means the Huskies, at a minimum, need to win one game and force the other game into a shootout. NCHC.TV will carry the coverage for this weekend's action at AMS Oil Arena. Puck drop on Friday is at 7.30 and Saturday at 7.00. Well, that does it for this week's episode, and remember to check out the SESU Huskies Athletics app for all your Husky sports news. I'm Alex Cotter, and this is What to Watch For.